We often hear about the ease and convenience of laptops, but tonight we hear about the danger. Elizabeth Herr talked with a Bucks County woman who was burned when her laptop exploded. Fire officials say it is not yet clear what went wrong, but preliminarily it looks as if the battery pack inside the laptop, much like this one, it blew up like a bomb. Here's the computer. From just a quick glance, it's difficult to tell how this laptop caused this much damage. These were all on fire. Next thing I knew, my shirt was on fire. And I grabbed that and took that off, and I think that's when I singed my hair. And even with her singed hair, burned face, arm, and foot, Loretta Luff of Langhorn Manor considers herself lucky. So this is essentially where, if I turn this around, it would go somehow in here. She says she is grateful she and her disabled husband escaped worse injuries when she says her laptop exploded Sunday afternoon. It blew up and it flipped my computer back and everything like the battery pack and all came out this way. The debris, she says, flew clear across the room six to eight feet. I've been a volunteer firefighter for almost 25 years now and fire chief. I'm in my 14th and I've never seen an exploding laptop before. It's the first time I've ever encountered that incident. Could have been a lot worse. This was her first laptop, a gift from her daughter. She says she's had it for six years without a problem and getting another is a possibility, but she will not be testing her luck again. I would take the battery out every night because whoever thought this would happen once and I would never take the chance of it happening a second time because I was lucky this time. The laptop in this case is from Dell and the company issued this statement. Dell will take appropriate steps to investigate this incident. It is also important to note that in our product documentation, Dell tells customers that using an incompatible battery or a third party battery may increase the risk of fire or explosion. Now the victim here, she says she did replace her battery about three years ago, but she is not sure if the replacement is from Dell. Official Officials here say this case remains under investigation. Reporting from Langhorn, I'm Elizabeth Hur, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.